chat GPT was a hundred percent right. I will say that I did get a really good comedic relief this week when Tara sends me a Slack. She goes, Hey, can I come up and bug you and show you something? Oh my God. What are you going to say? Oh no. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Of what <laughs> no, I'm so just, scared. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm like, oh, oh yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Come on up. Uh, she comes up and she's like, and she comes up and she's got her laptop. <laughs> and the first thing she's got open is a dialogue with chat GPT. And I look at the scroll bar and this <laughs> thing is tiny. Like, <laughs> like Tara and chat GPT have like their they, BFF. And she's like, so I did some things because we, we were, we, we were having problems with uh, replication mm -hmm. in the web mm -hmm. domain. She's like, so I think I fixed it. Well, I know I fixed it because replication work. I said, okay, cool. Don't really know, but but ChatGPT had a bunch of PowerShell and and I kind of ran it and it looks right. Oh my god, it was, there were so many things, you guys. But okay, let me tell my side of the story. I ask you for help like four times, and you're like, just do it. I'm like, I don't really think I should, but okay, I'll do it. Gosh, that makes me like. I've been going over these questions about AI and cybersecurity and stuff. Here's the thing, though. ChatGPT was 100% right. 